We are very proud to have such talented teams on our show floor and we're very excited to see the results of the at the end of the competition. Well, we're building a huge cluster, and for a student in our position, we don't usually have that much hardware on our hands. So this cluster there is worth a lot because we have very new technology, and it's just fun to experiment with all the, the new technology that we haven't seen before. And sometimes it's hard to get it to run, but um, most of the time it's just fun. I, I feel honored first and tired second. Um, it's, it's been a crazy trip so far with all the work before we, uh, we even got on the plane. And then of course once we got here we didn't exactly have a whole lot of time to sit around. We had to unpack everything and get it up and running so we could hammer out the last couple, couple problems and uh, get set and ready to go to compete. Uh, the competition here is sponsored by Airbus, uh, which without them we couldn't really do it and help provide help for the students in university to really come here and participate, uh, participate in the competition. Um, it's going to last three days. We have a great uh, starting ceremony uh, where we uh, have hide, hide the, the competition t-shirts of the universities uh, on the exhibition show floor. And they had to run and find those t-shirts before the, uh, they start the competition. Uh, now they're working on the LIMPAC and HPC challenge, which is an important step because that's going to be determined the actual configuration that they will use in the next two days for the application benchmarking. But you're the only one with one shirt. Others have five. Oh. Explain. Explain that. We're all kind of similar because we're all in it for the same competition, but it's interesting to see everyone else's background and how they approach their own set of problems at this competition. Well, it's basically just winning the title. There's nothing more to it, but the title's worth a lot because this, this uh, conference is very, very high class, I think. Each person will be responsible for different things. The teams, each student may have different expertise. So the, someone will keep watching the power limit, power usage, someone will prepare the data size, prepare the source code, someone will maybe prepare the compiler. So each one will do the different task. Basically overall, they need to run the application as fast as possible. But they should enjoy the competition. They need to watch other teams, what they're doing. They need to keep monitoring others, make sure they don't behind others. So it's, it will be very uh, interesting, very exciting. It's, uh, it's, it's interesting to work with the other teams. Uh, when we have a, a break from working on our own models, we can go and talk to the other teams, see how they're doing. Um, maybe learn some of the problems they're having, see if we can't help each other out. It's, it's a competition, but it's also, we're trying to work through the same problems. Um, so there's both the air of competition and of helping each other. Overall competition uh, winner was Tsinghua University from uh, China and KIT from Germany won the, fa won the fan favorite. Uh, so I think it's, you know, it was a great, uh, great uh, competition here, great opportunity for st the students to practice high performance computing aspects and to enjoy ISC in Germany. We were the first team to finish all of the applications. We, uh, we managed to get them all built and running. I think we did a pretty good job. I'm, I'm pretty satisfied. I kind of wanted to win the overall um, award as well, but you know, the, um, the Tsinghua University team was really good, so they deserve it, and uh, we're happy anyways. 
Next year we're going to run the competition again and have more teams here, so don't forget to follow us. Ha, ha, ha.